Nope, it's not because you're not Chad or Tyrone with a six-figure income and six-pack abs. But if you think that's what you need, then you're definitely in the right place today. Because one of these five surprising reasons is likely why you are unsuccessful in meeting women. If you're frustrated with your lack of love life, then it could be that frustration is one of the signs. Okay, we're gonna go from most obvious to most surprising. Number five, you're an introvert, lone wolf, or sigma. Hmm, interesting. So you either don't go out, or when you do, you tend to avoid people, including women. And no, you're not going to magically transport her into your living room. Maybe if she's AI, but if you want a real, real woman with flesh and fleshy flesh, then you're gonna to need to go out of your house. Number four, you don't have enough extroverted friends. <gasps> What if you don't even have any friends? That's a problem. We'll talk about that in a minute. But the reason why extrovert friends are valuable to an introvert is because extroverts tend to like to congregate with other people. That way you can meet people through people who are introverts. And if you meet women through friends of friends, they are more likely to be friendly and welcoming because you've already shown social proof by being associated with this other person that she knows and potentially trusts, at least in a social situation. Okay, but let's say you are an extrovert or at least you're an introvert getting out in the world and you're still not successful in meeting women. It could be because of number three, you're not initiating interaction. Even if you don't have any friends, if you go out in the world by yourself, you can still meet women if you learn how to initiate communication and engagement. And it doesn't mean that the first girl you meet is gonna be your forever love. Probably not. If you keep that in mind, then you won't get so invested in the outcome of the first time you talk to someone. It'll be more like, hey, I'm just gonna try this and see how I do. So if you are that one good guy who's not just into sex, not just into pump and dump, then you are going to stand out from all the other sleazy guys that talk to her. Unless she's only into the pump and dump too, which might be the case. In which case, that's her prerogative and you have a choice to make. All right, now this leads us to our next surprising reason why you're unsuccessful at meeting women. Number two, you have a negative confirmation bias about women or about life in general. This is understandable. It's a self-protection mechanism. If you've been disappointed in the past because you've been rejected or you've ended up with someone who's not great, then you have those past experiences that your subconscious mind is like, women are dangerous or all women are, insert negative whatever. And then if you have that attitude, it's gonna come across in all your interactions and you're gonna miss opportunities with women who are actually good women. Number one, you have a paralyzing fear of rejection. You get anxious, and because you feel like you're a shy guy, or maybe just not confident in the area of meeting women, you assume you're going to fail. So then you buy into the idea that women only want the rich, successful chads of the world. If you look around, you may start to notice, if you look for it, there are a lot of couples and there are very few Chads and Tyrones in those couples. The good news and the less good news is it's all about you. That's good because it means that even if you're not very good at something right now, you can learn to get better at it. That's you. You have that responsibility. You have that opportunity. The less good news is you're going to have to get out of your comfort zone to do it. Thanks for being here. God bless.